Tuli Walimatangi, Koko High School quarterback. You sat last year and you learned, you played some tight end. Yes, sir. And then what did you do in the summer? I um, went to a lot of um, camps just to go out there and compete with some of the kids in the mainland and um, just go out there and learn things, try to better my game. You said uh, Cole Brennan last year, he taught you something, he's teaching you more yes, this sir. year. What's um, he teaching you? Yeah, he's, he's been with us at practice a few times and a lot of stuff is um, footwork drills. He's doing a lot of footwork with us and um, just working a lot of stuff that happens in the pocket or just, um, yeah, fix So everything game. from like five step drop to seven to three. Yeah, um, our coach DJ works a lot with us on our drop because our drops are very important too, but. Yeah. Coach teaching like if yeah. pass rush comes in this way, you got to. Yeah, coach doing a lot of more, um, more pocket movement kind of drills, um, a lot of bags and cones. Yeah. So it's just a lot of footwork kind of things. Do you have a stronger arm than him? Uh, not right now, no. <laughs> he was yeah, accurate Cole, though. Yeah, that was his Cole, thing. He was accurate. I mean, we have. Uh, I stand like we we'll stand ten yards apart and throw the ball, and man, he still got the, his arm. So. Wow. A lot of it he says is from his hips. So he's just trying to teach me um, how to use my hips because he says it's not all arm, but. Okay, so the option is part of the package. Your, your mobility is going to help with the playbook. You said it's pretty much the same, yeah? Yeah, we haven't really put in anything like, anything really new. We're just opening up a little bit more, but everything's just the same, kept basic. Just, all right, thank yeah. you, man. Number 10. Clifford Ramsey, Kuku, linebacker. Uh, you're senior now. Yeah. It's a different it's a different situation though. Yeah. How different is it? Um just more responsibility to the team and more you gotta actually try harder this year. Uh the young guys coming in. What's that like? Um it's a lot of work. Um I think the younger guys just need to step it up and learn the plays, learn the schemes of the defense. There's a lot of patience involved. Yeah. yeah. Oh, is it like you, they have to make the mistakes for you guys to fix them? Um, yeah, they make a lot of mistakes. We just got to correct it. Yeah. Uh, Matt, the last two years, you had a lot of good linebackers. Yeah. Now, like, there's going to be young guys with talent, but you're the only one with experience. Uh, yeah. So what do you talk to them about? Um, I just say they got to try harder, learn the plays, come hard every play. All right, Thank you. With a junior, Coco High School, running back. A lot of guys graduated. You guys are still running the basic stuff. What's it been like so far? Uh, right now, it's just been uh, practice our basics for now. Um, just trying to get all the newcomers uh, the hang of everything. Um, but we're still trying to just learn all the basics. Last year, you had a good season playing fullback. Yeah. And then you had an injury, I think, at the end, yeah? yeah. What was that like sitting out when you were doing so well? Um, after I got my injury, um, I still wanted to play. I wanted to play so bad, but um, just sitting on the side watching my my friends play and um, seeing the smiles on their face, knowing that uh, they brought the championship home, really meant a lot to me. Uh, just um, I didn't care if I was injured. I just wanted my friends to be happy, all my teammates and. So wanted to bring the championship back home to go. You think your role this year is the same, pretty much up the middle, or they're gonna run you outside a little more? Um, yeah, I think I'm pretty much gonna be the same uh, up the middle. Um, play some tailback too, and a little linebacker as well. Oh, wow. all right, man. Stay healthy. Thank you. Uh, my name is Lamar Williams, Coco High School, defensive line and tight end. Number 90. The tight end is always uh, fun to watch when you're there, but your main your main role is defense, yeah. Yeah, correct. What's changed since your freshman sophomore year till now? Um, the speed the speed of the game is much more faster than uh, my sophomore, junior, and senior year. So I had to prepare myself by getting faster. So what does that mean? Come out to this field and do a lot of workouts? Oh yeah, a lot of bunch of workouts. Who work with you? Um, it actually looks a lot better on you guys. A lot of my uh, coaches, especially uh, our fitness coach, our weight training coach, uh, Walter Santiago, he coaches the whole team. What's the situation for college right now? 
um, decisions. How many how many offers you got? As of right now, I think about six. Yeah. What are the schools? Uh, University of Hawaii, University of Washington State, University of Oregon State, University of Utah, University of Wisconsin, and the University of Nevada. You're gonna wait till uh, till later to make a decision. Yeah. Yeah, that's a good move. Um, what's gonna be different for you uh, as far as being a senior? Uh, leadership. The key thing about us seniors is uh, leadership, and I take uh, great responsibility on that. Thanks, man. Thank you. Solly Alpha Lava, Coca High School, running back, safety. Number nine. Number nine. So the back, the defensive secondary, a lot of you, on you guys. Uh, so they're counting on you, right? Yeah. And yeah. running back, they need you there too. Yeah. What's that like? A lot of attorneys, seniors like Fungai, so we have gone and a lot of young DBs this year, so we're going to try and play both ways this year and try and balance up this, the DBs and running backs this year. Okay. Is it fun so far or is it just because there's so many uh, new guys coming from JV, is it more like you got to be more of a talker, leader? Yeah. I really used to being captain, but um, younger guys really count on me. I really gotta work harder because playing both ways, a lot of young people, um, players is counting on me and can't show my weaknesses. I gotta push them harder to be a better team. Alright, thanks, Lou. Thank you. Um, Reggie Torres, Cook High School head coach. Um, what, what year is this now as the head coach? He's been a uh, number eight. And then you've been with the school much longer. Yeah. Judo, wrestling. Football. Uh, I forget what your job is exactly. We are basically, you know everything that's going on. Kind of, pretty much. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this is. Uh, I, I, I don't want to say the word young, but there are a lot of guys coming up from JV, awesome seniors. So it's a different kind of year. Huh? It's a rebuilding year. Uh, we have a lot of young kids uh, that are trying to make impacts for our team. Uh, we, we look at starting to sophomores and safeties. Uh, against St. Louis, we might, might be starting to freshman on the whole line. So yeah, we're, we're very young and still getting better, still trying to at least. So the defense is secondary. That was a, that was a strength the last couple of years. That's a weak spot now. <laughs> no, they're young. Yeah. Um, Solely, I mean, athletically, he can play any position pretty much. Yeah, but we moved him to tailback. He's going to be primary tailback. Um, and some safety as a backup. Wow. Uh, and then Thule is the your starter at quarterback. 6'3", 223? Yeah, I used a tight end last year. So he's physical? Yeah. The O-line The O line is going to be somewhat young too, right? We got some return. It's just going to be a work in progress. That, that might take us half the season before we be clicking on all cylinders. Wow. So that, that kind of means, I guess, you got to keep things simple. Yeah. You have to master the basic stuff first. Yeah. Which, which is what we do anyway, so it's not too bad. Okay. The last two, you got, you know, you look like you can throw, big arm. Yeah, we, we can. With, with two, you know, it allows us to throw more this year. And, and quick passes you know, because of, of our youth in line. So. Uh, Lamon says, same as before, it's mostly defense. Once in a while, he's an offense. Uh, but I'm trying to figure out who's going to be your targets on offense if you have to throw the ball. Lamon's one of them. We move yeah. him with two men old, we move him wide out. He's a great hit, big target. Can really? Run. Yeah. Wow. He's one of our top kids. Um, you know, our, our receiver when he gets here, the number one, Nico. He's, he's, a, he's a threat. Nico Carvalho, yeah. senior. Well, he's got some work to do against Kabale. We did field goals and he missed the PAT, yeah. which goes to show him. Mean, you need you need to off-season train. So he's got a ways to go. You think because he's a high school kid, things success came easy, and he got bored? Well, yeah, he's a soccer player, yeah. So he loves soccer. So that's his first love. So he he did a lot of um so off-season AYSO and whatnot. Oh, so. He traveled. Uh, I don't know if he traveled. I know he just did a lot of AYSO or the off-season soccer programs. I know the soccer guys. They must look at 
place kicking is well, we're on the field for like five seconds and we're off, then we wait, then we on. So that's a, it's a mind game kind of. Well, if you don't play, this is best you to college. You don't get too many soccer scholarships here in Hawaii. Yeah. But the college that they're looking at his leg is a kicker. But he has to show that he can put in time. Yeah. Well, he, he, he wants to go to school. Uh, and uh, for now, and he knows that he, he's looking at going in as a kicker to foot, for football. Okay. Well, thanks, Coach. You, you said, why are we number one? Well, the coaches and the media, they voted you guys number one, but you said, you said rebuilding. Oh, we lost a lot of seniors and leadership. You know, that senior class was not only uh, great players, but great leaders. I mean, right now, this is a young group unproven. We got a lot of ways to go. And, you know, Punos, they return with 80% 80, 80 of their starters. I mean, they're loaded this year. You know, so you know they're they're they they got a lot and they're junior strong, mind you, they're junior strong, but they do have a lot of kids coming back. Yeah. So that's so why and I some of them are from uh, North Shore. Exactly, yeah. exactly. But that's why I thought they'd be picked number one. I my vote was for them to be number one because they, they got the team right now to beat. So, <laughs> Thank you.